Hello, hello, peoples. It is I, Potato Pikachu, and today we're going to talk about some amazing deals on some games that the Steam Summer Sale has to offer. I'm sure that a lot of you sometimes get tired of playing CSGO. I have the same sentiment and are looking for some new games to play, whether it be single player or multiplayer. And good games that are on sale equal to cheaper skins on the Steam market since people will be more willing to sell their skins to play the games that have suddenly went down in price. I'm also looking at a few games myself and since I don't want to use my card to pay, I would have to resort to selling some skins off, so I understand the reasoning behind it. However, people have been more patient nowadays so skin price drops have been less frequent so understand that as well when you watch my other Steam Summer Sale investment videos. But this video is not to talk about CSGO skins, but other games that you guys might want to play. Some games will be cheap and some will be relatively less cheap so to say so let's get right into some good deals on some games in this summer sale. The first game I'll talk about is Borderlands 3. The price it is currently at right now during the sale is $30, half of what it originally was. And the Borderlands franchise is one of my favorites as I do love to grind and shoot some heads with unique guns that the game has to offer. It can be played in both multiplayer and single player so you get the best of both worlds if you want to play solo or with friends. And there are a lot of unique guns in this game and a variety of classes that you can choose from with different abilities. So if you are into shooting heads, boss fights, loot grinding, and quests, then this game is perfect for you. The next game is Doom Eternal, which is also going for $30, half of the original price. It is a classic shooter where you shoot and kill some enemies in the most brutal way possible. Personally, I have never played any of the Doom games, so I don't really know much about it, but I have seen a couple of streams when the game was released and it looks to be really fun. So if you're into constantly killing enemies just for the sake of it, and with awesome guns and graphics, then this game is for you. If you're into scary horror games, then Resident Evil 7 Biohazard is for you. It is currently at $9.89, 67% off the original price. And the Resident Evil franchise has been long standing and a classic horror game with mutated zombies and lots of scares. The ambience that the game provides when playing it makes it all the more chilling and fear inducing. And Personally, I'm not that good with horror games so I personally won't buy it, but it does look like a really fun game to play if you're into that stuff. And also, there is also Resident Evil 2 going for $20 as well, so you could play that for the nostalgia's sake. Assassin's Creed Odyssey, a game where I didn't expect to be great at all, as I have played a little of some other Assassin's Creed games beforehand, but this one looks great. It is currently going for $19.79, 67% off the original price and you play as a Spartan which looks pretty cool. I might have to buy this game as I do enjoy single player games and this one seems to have an interesting plot development and good story writing as you go through the main quests and side quests. The mechanics also seem to be good as well so if you enjoy slashing and destroying enemies while going through an interesting plot then this game is for you. If you love adventuring and exploring beautiful landscapes, Shadow of the Tomb Raider, Definitive Edition is the one for you. It is going for $19.58, 82% off the original price. Originally it was $110, but now it is only $20 so it seems to be a good deal, but that could just be common market persuasion to make you believe you're getting a de good deal but that's besides the point. The graphics are absolutely stunning in this game as you explore tombs and take some heads off along the way. It's another single player game that maybe some of you might enjoy as did the thousands that reviewed it on Steam. Grand Theft Auto V, as I'm sure many of you have heard, is only going for $15. While the game is pretty old, being released in 2013, it still is a great game that you can enjoy playing single player or multiplayer in servers. There's a lot to do in this game whether it be heists, role playing, getting cool cars and houses, and so much more. This game is pretty self explanatory. I don't think there's any need to talk about it anymore. If you're looking for an FPS similar to CSGO then I suggest Rainbow Six Siege which is going for only $7.99. It is a really fun FPS that has a bunch of different classes on the attacker side and the defender side. It is a little slower paced game as compared to CSGO and the graphics are more realistic. So if you are into looking for another fun shooter then Rainbow Six is the way to go. Moving on we have Terraria. It is currently going for $4.99, a huge steal in my opinion, as the game has had an update to it that provided a bunch of new content for everyone to enjoy. It is similar to Minecraft where you mine ores and craft stuff, 
but where it diverges is there are a bunch of mini bosses to fight, a bunch of events that can happen, awesome weapons, scary monsters, and lots of mods if you ever get bored. Overall, you get hundreds of hours of content for the price of a sandwich, and you can play solo or with friends. Mods are in the game as well, so the content is endless. If you want to build a house, craft weapons, and fight enemies, then maybe you want to play Rust. It is currently going for $20 on the Steam market, and all you have to do is have fun. Whether you want to play alone on a server or with other people is up to you. I have been eyeing this game as of late, as it does look to be pretty fun, and I want to build a base and also raid other people as well. Want to stay on a raft all day? Then raft is the game for you. It is going for $14 on Steam, and what you do is upgrade your raft with materials that you find in the ocean, islands, and exploration. And it's just a fun little game with no main objective other than to survive and have fun. You can also play alone or with friends as well. The last game I will talk about is only going for $1 on Steam. One measly dollar. It's Balloon Tower Defense 6. I'm sure most of you have played the older Balloon Tower Defense games online whether it be on like cool math in school or somewhere else but generally these games are really fun in my opinion. You pop balloons with the monkeys you upgrade and that's it. Very simple yet very fun. And it's only going for $1 so you can't get mad at that. But anyways, that's all the games I will talk about today. Hopefully some of you fancy some of them and buy some new games to play. Getting away from CSGO sometimes and finding other games to play is very refreshing. And when you get back to CSGO, you enjoy it a lot again. A lot of these big titles are going for around $20, which is very reasonable considering the amount of content they provide. There are still tons of other games out there on Steam during this sale, so look around for some fun ones. If you want to see a video about some fun games under $10 or with a given price point, leave it in the comments so I know you guys want it. I'll do the research and you guys can just watch these videos. But that is all. Thanks so much for watching today's video. I made this video since I will be getting a computer soon. All the videos so far have been made on a $500 laptop so I'm sorry for the bad quality and gameplay that I've seen throughout the videos. Getting a computer will greatly improve everything from editing videos to playing games at higher FPS and resolutions so stay tuned for when the quality of the videos increase literally. And I also want to play some other games that I couldn't have played on my Judo laptop. So stay tuned for more content as I will be making another monthly guide for CSGO investing as the support from the last one has been insane in my most viewed video so stay tuned for that. Leave a like, comment your ideas for me to read, and subscribe. I'm a potato. Anna Pikachu, Potato Pikachu, signing out. Peace.